How much do you think a polar bear is? Any answers? Enough to break the ice. I'm Adam Weir and I work at Heavy Industries. We are a custom fabrication shop that makes giant things possible. <laughs> Just about anything you can imagine we build. It's my dream job. Everything that we create is done in, in the 3D world so that we can work out all the details and figure out how's this all going to fit together and how can we break it up so that those parts then fit together and, and work together. Each part would have been made out of multiple small sections, almost like a, a model kit. They're milled out of EPS foam, then it goes to our hard coating department. So there's hundreds and hundreds of hours put into each one of these bears just in handwork. We have a lot of skilled people in our, in our shop, a lot, of, a lot of sculptors, a lot of artists, but also people who are more technical in, in our shop. Now that we have completed bears, they're ready to go to the malls. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be fun to see people's reaction uh, when they see, all of a sudden see these giant bears in, in the mall. My name is Mike Matthews, I'm the site and safety manager, also the install manager, and I'm leading the install crew on the polar bear job for the Chinook Mall. We have a small concern that the butt of the polar bear may not make it into the entry door. However, we'll find out rather shortly. We're still not gonna make it. Keep going. There we are. Okay. Okay, guys, set her down. Perfect, guys. Uh, best thing about the job is to work with some really creative people and travel all over the world to set up objects that uh, I might have only imagined. We are only allowed to work when there aren't patrons going around the mall, so we have a very short install window. We will be working from 10 p.m. to about 8 a.m., and uh, then we have to be out again before people come in to open shop. At first glance, it looks like something that is impossible. People walk up to him and they're like, wow, that is cool. To see something that you've conceptualized or that you've, you've had a hand in that way is pretty exciting. Because it's the type of thing, you know, you, you're putting in a place where a, a lot of people are going to see it. A lot of people are going to be, be sort of touched by something that you, you imagined or you created. These are artworks. They touch people and they speak to people and they make people smile. <laughs>